So this week was the 4th of July, honoring our nation's birthday, and we've also honored a lot of the heroes that have gone before, those who have served our great nation. And next week, Hospice of the Big Country is honoring those veterans with a special dinner. So here to tell us more is Taylor Percival and Judy Farmer. Welcome, ladies. Glad to have you here today. Thanks so much for joining us. Uh, we've talked before, Taylor, about uh, Big Country Hospice, uh, Hospice of the Big Country, and what your services are You know, over here at the West Texas Rehab Center, and mm -hmm. ensuring that nobody faces the end of life alone yes you know, I mean it, it's a, such a it's a, a painful time for so many mm -hmm. it's an uncertain time it's I mean it, it's a very somber time and yet yes. you ensure that these individuals are able to face it with their hand held their mm -hmm. head held high and when we talk about veterans you know these are individuals who they're brave they face down danger and they have faced every situation and come through and so yes. you're able to assist these individuals yes and um, we're just very excited to um, have a time to bring these veterans and their families together um, to recognize and honor them for the time that they've served our country um, so it's just a good time for us to go and you know serve those who have served us um, and we'll have a catered dinner for them and then we'll do like I said some honor and recognition and we will provide them a small gift as well so we're very excited and this particular dinner you know we, we always honor our veterans regardless of where they served and when they served but this one is really sp focusing specifically on those that served during the Vietnam War our yes. Vietnam veterans which you know as as the years pass and we all and the years go by we all age and, and we get to a certain point and that's really kind of the, the generation that we're facing mm -hmm. and that are facing those um, end of life decisions and are, you know, and are coming of that age. So, yes. so focusing on Vietnam veterans, we love yes. that they're still here and they're still with us and we want they and even their families or even the survivors that are, you know, if their veteran has yes. passed on, we want their surviving family to be able to come and join and take part in this. Yes, most definitely. All right, and Miss Judy Farmer with us today as well. So you're actually one of the um, volunteers for yes. Hospice of the Big Country. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. And this is not your first go around. You have been <laughs> a hospice volunteer for a number of years. Yes, since 2006. So something keeps you keeps you coming back, and you know when most of us think about that, sitting with a family and helping them navigate us, um, such a, a a painful time. Some for some mm -hmm. of them, for some for mm -hmm. others, for it's very uncertain. It's you know unfamiliar, um, and it's kind of a scary situation for others. Mm -hmm. But you continue to do this. Yes. What brings you back? Just being able to be there for the families and for the patient, the one that is, um, you know, that is dying but to be there for their families to provide an opportunity for family members to go out shopping and if they just need some time away and or to give them some relief that's very much a big part of it giving the caregivers some relief well it is because yes. for them it's round the clock it's, yes. it's non-stop exactly. and and yet you know and when that time comes it's that's, that's a little uncertain still as well it could yes. be weeks yes. it could be months it, it, there's no definitive time frame that's not something we're all privy to out there no. but in the meantime if they are still with us we would love for them to come and be part of this dinner we would love to honor them and yes. uh, recognize all of them and we thank all of the volunteers as well for sharing their talents and their time yes we thank couldn't you. do what we do without <laughs> them so well and like they're we, very we, special we've mm -hmm. talked about the West Texas rehab and all it does and it truly being able to provide these services to anyone and everyone who needs them is a, is a great gift you have continued to do done for decades now here in the big country. Yes. Thank all you. right, ladies, thank you so much. We would love for the rest of you all though, to come out and join us. This dinner is happening next week. So you've got one week. Reservations are required for this, but there are still places and spaces available for you if you'd like to come out. It's at the West Texas Rehab Center. It's at the boardroom. They're at 4601 Hartford Street. Again, Thursday, July the 14th at 530. The seats are limited. So again, call the number on your screen for the, your RSVP for the families and even the veterans that are still with us. We, you can save that spot calling the number 793 Four five zero.